hi guys um obviously there's something very very odd and strange i have one eye done one eye not done but this is just a sort of live review of the toothpaste shadow insurance critically so it comes in a 11 gram tube uh, 0.35 ounces uh, I got this at Boots, it's quite pricey it's 16.50 for it um, I got it the day I got paid so you know I've been that was that was the one purchase that I was making with my paycheck um, so got it um, sort of forgot about it for a while now I tested out tested it out on loose pigments because it's supposed to be very good for loose pigments loose pigments held like a dream and was stuck like a dream but obviously it's called glitter glue you know it's for glitter so what I have done here is I opened my eye and I just sort of went round the crease of my eye with my angled brush I just went like that just the whole way around and sort of off a little tiny bit um, and then just filled it in just I did it with a wee bit of gel line, liner you don't need a whole lot because you're just sort of using it as a base for what do I need to colour in what do I not need to colour in so I coloured my whole lid in I used the teeniest tiniest of my this because it's so expensive and because you really don't need it um, so whenever it comes out it's quite sticky and then whenever you're dabbing it on you can feel it becoming very tacky it's, it kind of reminds me of lash glue you know it will become tacky whenever you start you know working with it and using it so I then just got a flat brush like that not that one obviously because it's not covered in glitter but just got like that dipped it into my follow loose glitter and just pressed it on really really lightly and yes there was fallout you know before you ask there was fallout but there was always going to be fallout it's loose glitter so just sort of gently patted it on packed it on and as you can see the glitter is sticking it's not going around here it sort of fell in ow sort of fell in around my lash line a wee bit but makeup wipe fixed that um so that's what it looks like up close you know that's what the eye open so you can see it a little bit further up um all i can say on the matter so far is i've done two swap like two test runs of it this being one this part pigments being yesterday um, I use Barry M Dazzle Dust, just in case you're interested. And so far, my sixteen fifty is very well spent. So, if you're into loose pigments, you know, if you like working with loose pigments and you like working with loose glitter, just fork out the money and get this because, you know, I've done two trial runs of it, not even a full trial run of it, and I love it already. So. Uh, I hope that was useful. If it wasn't, then sorry. But you know, yeah. So, yeah. That's really all I have to say on the matter. So, I'm just going to go take this off now because I just wanted to play, to be honest. So, uh, I still have a couple of videos to post up I have recorded. I'm in the middle of recording my blush green one. So you'll be getting one on that and then you'll and then you'll be getting a review on the Stata Smudge Stick Waterproof Eyeliner. So this is just a wee quick update. Um and I guess I'll see you guys soon.